Hello friends, this video on nutrition in animals part 14 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. With this we have reached towards the end of this lesson. So let us quickly have a look at some of the questions. Question number one. Fill in the blanks. The main steps of nutrition in humans are. So what are the important steps? There are five steps in nutrition. First is intake of food, which is ingestion. Next is co conversion of complex food into simpler forms, that is digestion. Then is absorption of the digested food. And then assimilation of the absorbed food to release energy as and when needed. And finally, throwing out the undigested food of the body, that is ejection. The largest gland in the human body is... Which is the largest gland we spoke just some time back? It's liver and the liver secretes the bile juice which helps in uh, digesting fats and also creates an alkaline medium where the pancreatic enzymes and the intestinal enzymes become active. The stomach releases hydrochloric acid and dash juices which act on food. So stomach releases the digestive juices and these digestive juices contain pepsin which helps in digestion of proteins. The inner wall of the small intestine has many finger like outgrowths called villi and due to the presence of these villi the intestine is able to absorb the digested food. Amoeba digest its food in the where the digestion happens inside amoeba inside its single cell intracellular digestion but where inside the cell in the vacuole we spoke about the food vacuole in amoeba so inside the vacuole the digestion happens because the digestive enzymes are released by this vacuole question number two mark true or false digestion of starch starts in the stomach This is false. That's because the digestion of starch. Starch is nothing but carbohydrate. So carbohydrate digestion starts in the mouth itself by the action of salivary amylase. The tongue helps in mixing food with the saliva. Yes, correct because the tongue is has got a lot of mobility. So it helps to move the food. Gallbladder temporarily stores bile. That is also true. Bile is secreted by liver but it is stored by the gallbladder. The ruminants bring back swallowed grass into their mouth and chew it for some time. That is also true because in the rumen the food is acted upon by the bacteria which digest the cellulose and again it is brought back to the mouth and the entire process is repeated. Question number three. Choose the correct answer in each of the following. Fat is completely digested in the stomach, mouth, intestine, small intestine or large intestine. Now large intestine is not possible because here ejection happens. Mouth is also not possible because here ingestion happens. In stomach, fats cannot be digested. Why? Because in stomach, the digestion of proteins take place. Their environment is acidic there. So the digestion of fats happen in the small intestine. Water from the undigested food is absorbed mainly in the... So this absorption of water takes place in the large intestine. Because large intestine is associated with the process of ejection. So it absorbs all the excess water and then releases out the undigested food in the form of feces. Question number four. Match column one with column two. So these are the components which you have in column one and two. Food components. So food components are nothing but the products of digestion because on these components the process of digestion happens. Carbohydrates. Which of these are carbohydrates? Sugar. Yes. Proteins. Proteins are made up of amino acids. Fats. Simpler components of fats are fatty acids and glycerol. Question number five. What are villi? What is their location and function? So villi are the tiny hair-like outgrowths, the finger-like projections 
and they are present on the inner wall of the intestine. So due to the presence of these hair like structures, the absorption is done by intestine. So the intestine is able to absorb the digested food and that is the most important function of villi because without villi, the small intestine would have not been able to absorb the digested food. Question number six. Where is the bile produced? Which component of food does it help to digest? So bile is produced by the liver. This is liver and it produces bile. However, the bile is stored in the gallbladder. And what does it help to digest? Bile, first of all, bile helps to uh, digest fats and it also makes the environment alkaline because of which the pancreatic and intestinal enzymes can also become active. So liver produces bile and bile helps to digest fats. Question number seven. Thank you. Please visit www.examfear.com to watch more educational videos with a better experience. Please do not forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for latest updates. Thank you once again.